Hi everyone! Today I'm going to show you how to do a Dutch fishtail. You might have seen this hairstyle on my Instagram or on my blog a couple of weeks ago, so today I'm going to show you how to do it. This hairstyle works better if you have dirty hair because when your hair is clean it's really slippery, so the fishtail braid is going to be a little bit harder. So if it's the dirtier it is, the better. We're going to start by teasing the top section on the side that you want to use for your fishtail. Alright, once you have it teased, we're going to do kind of a rough section of what we want to use for our fishtail. It doesn't have to be perfect, just kind of get an idea of what hair you want to use for that fishtail. Like I said, it doesn't have to be perfect, um, just kind of get a rough idea of what hair you want to use. Once you have that, just take the rest of the hair kind of get it out of the way. Alright, to start this fishtail you're going to grab a section right in the middle of the big section you have for the fishtail. Doesn't need to be too big, just kind of grab a little section that you want to start with. We're going to separate that in two. All right, now we're gonna start the fishtail. When you're doing the fishtail, instead of taking the pieces and pulling them over, we're gonna pull them under. Take a piece, separate it, put it under, and pull it into this side. And then do the same thing on the other side. Take a piece from the outside, and put it under. All right, now we're gonna start gathering pieces in. So this is where it gets a little bit tricky. We have that piece. Now grab a little bit from this main section and cross it under to the other side. Same thing over here. All right, once you get to the bottom, don't put your hair tie on yet because we're gonna loosen it up. So keep a hold of those two pieces and we're just gonna start pulling on it. All right, once you've loosened it up, go ahead and put your elastic on. You could just leave this hanging. It looks really cool, just kind of hanging down like that. You could put it into a ponytail, which is how you might have seen it on my Instagram. Or you could do half up. Or 
or you could pull it into another braid. So you have a lot of different options with this hairstyle. I really encourage you guys to give it a try. It's kind of difficult, so if you don't get it the first time, try again. I had to watch a couple tutorials to get it myself, so and it took me about three tries to get it right. So don't be discouraged if you don't get it the first time. If you try it, please tag me in any Instagram or Facebook or Twitter, whatever it is. Tag me so I can see it. Let me know what you think.